Hello everyone, welcome back to Outfist playing Dead Cells. This is daily time. I'm quite enjoying these dailies. It's been a few days since I played. Let me in. It's been a few days since I played. I appreciate that there's no sort of real demand on me to spend my time. I mean, it's only 10 minutes a day. Oh, really? Bring it. Um, on my to play the daily every day. It's not necessary, which is great. So let's do our usual trick. We explore for a while. Appreciate that it's the um, it's the first floor all over again. So we know that we can usually get through this floor without taking any damage at all, unless we don't notice there's a zombie. We'll kill everything for now. Um, nice. Honestly, it, it's like. It kind of gives me the impression that in real life we could probably get through the first floor without taking any damage at all. Explosive decoy turns you invisible for two and a half seconds. Oh, probably this. Hit me. It's not very long, but that's okay. Um, that's probably not either of those. Is what I know. I went silent for a while there. Very much confused by this game, which is not cataclysm. Uh, how how what? How play do? Ah, uh, but I, I honestly think it kind of doesn't matter which one you take in that situation. So take what you will. We have a shield of spiky nature. Um, I, I since this is the most basicest dungeon, I'm not too unhappy with taking the cursed sword straight away like this, but I do think that if we're going to keep hold of it, unless we have amazing skills, we're basically going to be hoping, and I say basically a lot, that we uh, missed, oh, no, <coughs> can replace our melee weapon ASAP, basically, 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 it's my favourite word, my um, granddad told me off for saying basically too much. I, was, I remember it was a long, long time ago in a galaxy far, far away, and no, I don't want to go that way because it tells me to, so let's go this way. Um, I hadn't actually clocked that on the first time. My brain registered it, but like the the fight part of my brain said, hey, you're going the, the right way, i.e. towards the boss, and the rest of my brain said, uh-huh. <laughs> yeah, that's what we want. Especially if we can get some sort of... Um, you know, I'm gonna change change it over now. See, this is a problem. <laughs> I'll keep it as it is for now. At least we know we can replace our melee weapon if we want to, um, which means we might just want to start with the boots because the boots. Um, it was Doom. I was playing Doom for basically. Oh, <laughs> I'm realizing now. Stop saying it. Um, essentially, to all intents and purposes, I think it was literally the first time Doom was a thing, the original Doom, when it was first a thing. So now what we can do is we can replace this with this, and then do this. I'll sort of leave that there. <laughs> I don't know. I don't even know if I necessarily want the shield. Ow. I mean, that kind of happened last time, but who cares about these baddies, right? Um, oh, uh, an arrow. And he asked me what it was, how it works. You know, what is this game? And I said, well, basically. He said, no, don't tell me basically. <laughs> don't tell me basically. Because I think that's essentially like a personal idiot. You know, it, it, it doesn't mean anything. It has no intrinsic value as a word, except it's there. You know? it, it, it lets me start talking. What, why do I say basically? Is there a reason for saying basically? I, I honestly don't know. Well, basically. Thank you. Well, nice. I mean, I'm taking my time here. It's not necessarily what I want to do. But I didn't know how to explain the game Doom to an elderly man when I was essentially a young child myself. I mean, I can't tell you how old, how old would I have been. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Hello. I think this wins us the, the boss. Yes. 
right here. There's a lot of this floor. So we do know which way we want to go. I don't know if we did want to go the wrong way. For, ooh, yo, 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 yo. Okay. Um, we can also take way less time if we want to. Wait, what? What did I think of? <laughs> it wasn't what I thought it was. This is a lightning bolt. Hold to inflict critical hits. Right. I, I don't understand how it works, so I'm not using it correctly. My mistake. I don't know. I don't. I still don't. <laughs> how would you understand? How would you explain Doom to somebody who is sort of preconditioned not to understand it? I, I, I don't know either. Sorry. We do not have much time left right here. Just saying. Oh, jump. I have plus five something. Oh, see. It's basically I'm Emperor Palpatine. Uh, trying to subdue a young Luke Skywalker. An un... Uh, well, I was going to say an un impression. <laughs> I don't know what I was trying to say. An un what? An un broken Luke Skywalker? I think it was about to be broken, so... Ah, ha, ha. I don't know what this plus five over my head is. It seems to have happened when I got... Oh, I see. It's not plus five points for getting the star. I've only just realised it's plus five points for every enemy that you kill whilst you have it over your head. So I don't know which weapon we really want here. Or indeed, how to speak English. So... We should explore a little bit more. I think I could probably kill the boss like this, but why bother? We, we know what's around. So, we might as well explore, learn where the things are. Don't fight me, Pete. Help. <laughs> Let me out. Leave me alone. I'm not into this. <laughs> so, not worth fighting the elite, good to know. Ha ha ha. Um, where, how, how does it mean hold to inflict critical hits? That is not a way for it. I don't know. Only nine seconds left, that's fine. What is that? Let me know. I need to know. Lacerating Aura 2. Inflicts damage on nearby targets. Basically makes me a grenade, I guess. 30 second cooldown. You're okay, I'm not. Right, so we're out of time, that's fine. Uh, let's try this again, because that's why we're here. Let me have a sip of my tea. Right, still hot. Wah, 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 wah. Right, so we want to go. Let's have a look. Uh, I think down here was where we replaced our weapon. We have to go this way. I think everywhere I went was fine, but we could just sort of leg it, <laughs> is what I'm thinking. We do start with... um. Oh, I've brought the boots back. We do start with a sword, by the way. We don't have to take that thingy. Give me the... That's good. Uh, we don't have to take the cursed sword at all. We can just keep the sword that we have. What are these ones? Additional damage if I hit a wall. So now we take this and move on. I don't know if we want to go for points. Points seem different. There is that crusher, actually. Um... I think I want the Crusher and the Death Orb, so we'll do that. That's fine. We don't have to kill everything. And it, actually, it was kind of satisfying to walk up to that enemy there and then just sort of kick it into the wall. Say, so get out of my way. I'm busy. Don't you know who I am? Don't need that shield, that's for sure. Nope, not this way. Nope. Like that. Yes, good. We don't need to go in. Oh, there. I probably wouldn't have taken that damage if I was using the uh, Cursed Sword, by the way. So don't worry about it too much. I know there's a star, actually. I probably should have picked it up. Never mind. We want to try and be a little bit swifter than we were last time. Where are we going? It's the only way. Anyway, as I was saying, I couldn't explain Doom to my granddad without saying the word basically, right? And I honestly don't think that's necessarily a bad thing. I mean... There's nothing here. You forced me into a trap. 
It's not even a particularly good trap, it's just a trap of conscience. Should have picked that up on the way back. Never mind. So we want this to replace this. I don't even use the explosive decoy. And then we go up here. I think the uh, cursor only comes back when we're in a, a place where it might matter, actually. So it's kind of okay. You know what? Uh, I don't know which one to take. This will do. Right. How would you explain the game? Bear in mind, this is an elderly relative, so he doesn't know... He doesn't necessarily even understand computer games at this point. We also took a long, long time ago here. Um, and... Uh, right, we did that. We didn't want to do that last time, so we shouldn't have done that this time. There we go. Uh, wasted a bit of time there, so remember not to go down that way. I got um, excited by the coloured section of the map, thinking, ooh, there's more stuff here. What caused that crit? Does it just happen eventually? Yeah, I think it might do. The longer you spend holding down the button, the more critty it becomes. Do I then get crit bonus, bonus from the sword once my lightning bolt starts doing crits? Is that a thing? I don't know. Let's not kill everything. We don't need to. Uh, did we want to go this way? I forget. Right, don't need to do that. And we don't want to do... Wait. I think this might be the way that takes us to that weird thing that I'm not sure is any good. Because I've never used it before. And I, I did notice, by the way, that we could take the... Um, the the broadsword, I think it's called. Uh, the reason I didn't is that we don't have a frost blast, we have the lightning sound. Let's just go up here. I'm going to try this, because I'm not using either of our things anyway, even though, honestly, I really should have been. Because that would have been an amazing time to get a shitload of points just from pressing the button. Press this. Thank you. Uh, with my plus five above my head. I really tried to roll, but I think I didn't manage to roll past the shield, which is a problem there. Cursed treasure. Sure, why not? Give me cursed treasure. I basically played the first half of this map with uh, <laughs> thingy on anyway. Oh, that's really good, actually. So I'm going to change that. And then going to remember that I now have a ranged weapon, so I don't have to worry about it. So we want to go that way. We don't want to go this way. We do want to go this way, because that got us something good. Right? That was the death orb. This was... So we want to go some that way, but not all that way. I don't know if it's actually quicker to go back. It is quicker to go back. We want to go this way or not this way? Right? This is actually a really... I don't want to necessarily say tactical. That might be over-egging the pudding a little bit. But, um, it's certainly a... Um, I'm more of a thinker than usual. Oh, wow. I'm interested in this. That's pretty cool. Huge cooldown, though. I hope that our uh, explosions don't hurt us. Yikes! Here you go. That'll probably follow me until uh, Kingdom Come. So there we go. Well, I've only got nine seconds left, so we're still learning... <laughs> I'm trying to get points for some reason. Stop trying to get... No, I'm trying to lift the curse, yes. I'm not... 25 points, that's nice. And there's another one here which contains... Before we end thingy... Perfect, right. Twin daggers is better than everything we've had so far, so we don't need to take the oil sword at all. We just need to get here. Okay. Good to know. <laughs> I mean, this is like Simon. You know, the game where you have to copy what the thingy does. Get off the screen. It's annoying, sorry. So... Don't worry about most things right now. Just get out of here. I don't care how you get there, just get there if you can. I want to kill this because it might hurt me when I don't want it to. I wish it wouldn't keep jumping away from me, that was very naughty of it. So we don't want to go that way anymore. We don't need to. We will take this and use it occasionally. Simply because um, 
It has a decent. Oh, it's got a terrible cooldown, actually. <laughs> Um, because it would give us some opportunity to avoid taking much damage from occasional areas where there's too many enemies for me to get through without getting hit. Thanks to this accursed sword, which is literally a cursed sword, so it wasn't so much of a pe pejorative name for the sword as I was expecting it to be. I thought I was being clever. Uh, let's double check that we haven't gone. We have not gone not the right way. If that makes sense. All of our ways have been correct. Nice. Don't need that because I haven't been hit yet because <laughs> that was the goal. Don't get hit. I do have to kill some things because otherwise they'll be there when I get back and it's going to be bad for me. But not everything, so that's fine. Pretty soon, I mean, we could beeline for... My goodness, it was far away. So we don't want to go down that that one, so... Okay. Luckily, there's none of those particularly heinous and onerous enemies down here. I did use both of them by accident, because I panicked, okay? It's like a panic bomb in, you guessed it, The Binding of Isaac. Um, so I want to go... Where? I'm not sure. Uh... Double check. Correct, we are going the right way. Keep going this way. Good. Have this. Nope, not that way. I can actually use the minimap, I'm just I just don't. <laughs> I forget. Uh I, I mean I'm capable of it, not I'm allowed to. I know I'm allowed to. So use that. Kill that. Kill that. Don't get hit by that. And then do that. Excellent. Oh dear. Uh, we are going this way because I kind of want that. Right. Bro! Oh, jeez. No! That was just not the right place to be. Look, I think we're doing okay. This is one of the longer dailies, unfortunately. And I'm aware that I'm going quiet a lot, but I am using this cursed Ed sword for a reason. And the reason is, it's great. I can understand why this thing exists in the game. Um, I think it's easy to sort of dismiss it as a silly idea. But honestly, I think it's fine. I think it's a perfectly good sword. Um... I don't want to bring enemies closer to me. You know, I'm not. Um, I'm not going for the hippie run. I'm going for killing power. You did not hit me because I was rolling. He saw me rolling. He hating. That's what that was all about. <sighs> it's, it's a minor inconvenience that it takes so long to load, but only minor. So don't worry about it. I wouldn't mind a couple of points as well, but I'm running past all the enemies because they're so dangerous. I was actually kind of hoping to kill that with a stump. But, um, so that went down the way it did. Rather, well, it didn't go down the way it didn't. Give me this. Then RT this joke. Nice. I don't know if invisibility is doing much for me. Like I'm guessing it might be, but who knows, right? So, um, I thought we had five minutes. I was going to say that's a lot of time that we have available to us. We do not have five minutes, we have maybe three or four. Please don't attack me whilst I'm doing the things that involve you not attacking me. <laughs> it's all the same. Nice. So, we want to go down here, sure. But I want that skill, which I should really be using more of. Remember, we don't have to come back this way. So don't kill everything if you don't have to. I'm also double thinking... Like, well, I don't know if it's double thinking, but like... I'm, I'm second guessing myself as to whether getting the... Um, the other skill, the thorny one, is worth it either, to be honest.
because of the wonderful things you've missed. Um, I don't know if we're going to replace it, and it's kind of difficult to get to because of all the enemies that are hiding out at the bottom of the, the ravine there, trying to prevent me from getting to it in the first place. I do appreciate that I'm doing so much DPS on these zombie thingies that... One! <gasps> oh, hi, hi! Oh, hi, 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 um, that uh, I don't really have to worry about them hitting me, unless there's many of them, which often there is, so I do kind of have to worry about it. Maybe I'll rethink my, uh, my words there. Right, we managed to get it. That is what we wanted, and we'll replace this because... Why the heck not? And also, go down. You. The, uh, the five bonus points, I'm really not looking to <laughs> make too much out of that. Um, we might as well take the Cursed Ed's chest because... We're already Cursed Ed, so that's fine. I believe that now we go... Yeah, if we keep going up here. Now we go back to where we were. And we can go up and to the right, I think it was. And that's where we can replace this Cursed Sword. You did what? How did you jump that far? I'm so upset. I'm getting salty. This is doing my head in. Is it doing your head in? Probably. What happened to the good commentary about your granddad not understanding Doom? Mate, are you seeing this run? We are getting there, okay? We'll save the granddad understanding Doom for the overpowered run that we have in the, uh, in the main game just next. Coming up. Check that episode out. Just don't attack anything. <laughs> Just run. I don't think we want to go that way necessarily. I can't dodge everything, my dude. I can't dodge everything. You can, however, put down a decoy. <laughs> Four minutes and six seconds left on the clock because I died. And I'm convinced that the Spartan Sandals are not the right thing to pick. I'm not convinced that changing my basic sword is the right thing to do. But can you imagine running around here with the lame sword that you start with? Yeah, now I think about it, that just sounds like a, a cosmic joke. Nice. Don't forget, if you jump and then slam, you do do a little bit more damage on the, on the actual slam itself. Leave me alone. I want to be down here. There we go. Go. There we go. Plenty of extra points there. I didn't really need to put that down. It might have turned out. That's okay. My DPS has gone way up for some reason. I do like this uh, major all three stats thingy. It's very cool. Just leg it. We want to go down this way. Grab that, grab this. Alright, we're getting a little bit faster, I think, each time as well, which is really useful. Because <laughs> the less time we spend in the vicinity of enemies, the less likely we are to get shot by one. So we want to go up here. Ooh, careful. Whew. I don't know why sometimes I'm doing uh, one hit per enemy and sometimes it's taking me a couple of goes. I'm also not going to try and overthink it because let it be. Nice. Die. Good. Whew. I don't know why I'm putting so much effort into eradicating these monsters, but I guess it might be worth it because... The points. Can you imagine the points are good? Let's go over here, pick this up, and then do that. What hit me? I. I know what happened. I saw what happened, but I felt like shouting, "What hit me?" is the correct thing to do. This is going to be a longer episode than some actual episodes. Then again. Normally on uh, another episode, I, I die faster. I'm going to do it one more time, and then we'll go with the sandals. Why do I start with a sword? 
what benevolent overlord has decided that I should be able to fight for my freedom in the first place? So benevolent. <laughs> what? What would you call it? A, 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 a gamer overlord? You know, gamifying my capture in the first place. What? There was an arrow and I didn't see it. The previous one, when I said I know what happened, what happened was I tried to turn around to use my death orb to fire it at the enemies, but there's no way, as far as I can tell, of turning around without taking a small step at least, and I think I was just that much too close to the edge. That it just didn't go well for me. <laughs> this is so much less satisfying, even though I don't have to use the cursed sword, so it should be exactly the right thing to do. I guess now I should be pulling enemies towards me. Okay, uh, thing is, now that this is unsatisfying, I I don't I feel like I'm going to be able to get through the whole game without killing anything if I really want to, Just because I don't really see the need in punching anything anymore. Because they have to be up against a wall for it to be any good. I don't know why I keep going this way. It's not necessary. Um, maybe after a couple of these scrolls, my sandals will be better, but. They just don't feel like they're going to do any good to anybody. Which means we should really make a beeline for something else. Maybe just like start off by going for the, uh, the oiled sword, which at least is a sword. Struggling to think that the Spartan sandals would be good in any situation, to be honest with you. They just feel so wet. <laughs> I think that's the thing, they don't seem to do anything cool. Ow. I mean, if you're standing by the thing, I guess it still, you know, hits you <laughs> when they attack the thing. See, just kicking these back, all it's doing is get them out of my way. I'm not interested in them being out of my way. I'm interested in them giving me points. Okay, I have this. Because if I can just run around, I don't want to kill anything. But it proves that I can, you know kill the things, or, or rather get to the places I want to be, without killing the things. For example, if I go down here and don't get hit, I can get this. And if I can get this, I meant to <laughs> replace that rather than, I can do this. And if I can do this, I can just sort of run around and things die, which is great. And then I got hit, so that would have been, um, but like, I don't have to. I can just go around and not kill anything, which is actually more satisfying than trying to kill anything. Especially when you have... Oh, do you know what? I forgot about the cursed bow. Not the cursed bow, the, the explosive bow that I have here. Give me that. Give me that. So I should really be using this to uh, get the curse lifted. Appreciate that thing there having been... Uh, activated earlier because nice. see I'm already at five of my ten cursey bits. What's the range on this thing? I just keep firing. Let's do this. How are you blocking that? Is literally covering your entire being. First left. Nice. That's what I should have done last time. Why didn't I? I failed. Simple. Now we get this, which is exactly what we want, so we give that back. There we go. Use this. Go over there. There's another scroll of power around the corner. We'll get that and we'll leave, basically. Hello. That. Let's get out of here. I don't need anything else. I think this is more than enough to beat the lame boss thingy. Provided it's the concierge again. Can't believe we start with such a, a pitiful pair of items, to be honest with you. Give me this, and we will do this. This will recharge well in time for us to use it on the boss, in my opinion. Even though it's right here, because we're going to use the uh, the other skill on the boss. I didn't find anything else that could have really helped us, I think. I don't really want to bring the concierge towards me. Right, forgot about that. I forgot that it started in... Um, in default. Oh! Um, last level mode, I guess. Oh, I can just use this. Alright. 
Do the jump. There you go. It's not me. Not the one that I have to jump. Back jump. And let me do this. Right. There's no way I'll be able to fight the concierge with the cursed sword because I'm completely incapable of paying sufficient attention to uh, avoid the attack that it's actually doing rather than the attack that I think it's about to do. That's okay though. Look how much health we take off with each shot from that explosive crossbow. So if we pick that up on the way past, even though it's in the cursed chest, we're so much more likely to win if we want to try again. Which I don't, but if you... I mean, you've probably already uh, failed today, if that's what's happening. I can't believe that fired in that direction. Die. Haha! <laughs> Seven seconds left. That's not going to be very many points, but at least we did it. We've only got one victory left before we get a new reward, which is brilliant. Well, <gasps> half an hour to do a daily is ridiculous. Luckily, you don't. <laughs> none of this is. Um, uh, I now at rank 358. I don't know what that's like in terms of other people. Does it tell you what it's like in terms of other people if you look in the right place? That's a good question. Let's talk to this person. Heard the monsters get nastier and nastier. Seems being cursed isn't all bad. It didn't say. Maybe we can have a look. I want to know what 358 is out of. Because that could be last if not many people are playing the daily. Doesn't really say. That's a shame. It would be nice to know. Well, thank you for watching. I apologise that the daily run lasted so long, but it did take us a few goes to go through it. And of course, I did make a lot of... I don't want to say it was experimental, but we did use a weapon we'd never used before in the form of the Cursed Sword, which is like having a curse, except you don't have range. So that was a bit difficult, but I think I did quite well, if I do say so myself. So I hope you agree. You better agree in the comments below. And you better leave a like on the video to let me know that you liked it, which you did. And subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. And if you have subscribed already, go and get somebody else and make them subscribe as well. But thank you for watching. Until next time, I'll see you.